Okay, we're live, you guys. Hi, everybody. Thanks for joining. I see everybody on the side chat right now. Hello and welcome to today's purse sale. My name is Kim and I do thrifting and reselling on bags and wallets. So if you're interested in purchasing an item, please send PayPal through the link I've added below. Um, all sales are final and only shipping within the US and all items are used. So, unless I state otherwise. So, hello everybody. We're just gonna go ahead and get started and get this thing, get this crack a lack in you guys. I have some really great bags. And so I'm gonna I have my pile right next to me right here. I'm in a much more comfortable position than I usually am. I'm sitting on my couch this time, which makes it great. So, hi everybody. How are you guys doing today? Thank you, Sherry. Hope everybody's having a fantabulous day. Okay, you guys, we're gonna go ahead and get started. First, I'm going to show you this Michael Kors wallet. It's got a little indention on it from bags laying on it, but it is authentic Michael Kors in a black pebbled leather. This opens up and you can put your coin in it, whatever you like. Know that everything you see right now has already been listed below. So if you don't wanna wait until this video is over, go ahead and you can purchase it right now. You don't have to wait. And then just come back here and let me know that you purchased it. So all of our friends will also know that it is no longer available. There's the Michael Kors emboss. All of your card slots. Lots of pockets. Really nice black pebbled leather. And it's just a really, really super nice wallet. It's got the little Michael Kors um, button right here. And then I'm gonna go ahead and wipe this down with some leather cleaner and just kind of polish it up for you before it goes, okay? All right, that's number one out of the way. Actually, I'm gonna do it right now as we speak. Let's just get her all prettied up for you. See the sheen? So pretty now, like brand new. Let's get all the inside polished up. Yes, Sherry, they are listed. Just click the box below, just like always, and everything is there for you. Can you guys see that they're listed below? Just out of curiosity. Is Sherry the only one that can't see them at the moment or can you guys, can nobody see it right now? That's what I thought. Thank you, Kristen. Okay, next I have this patent leather Dooney and Burke. And it's got the Vaquetta leather trim. This is an authentic Dooney and Burke. It has the front pocket. Thank you, everybody. I appreciate it. Okay. I figured. I figured. Just wanted to double check. Little cute little ties on the side. It does have an adjustable strap here and on the back. Okay, zip top closure. The interior is red with a slip pocket and a zipper pocket. And then here, it also has the little key lanyard. Okay, and then here's your little Dooney and Burke emblem. And then it's also got the little special tag in here too, right here with the Creed number, Union Burke. And it's a nice medium to large size bag. Okay. All right, next we have this. I sold one just like this a couple of videos ago. And I have this one today in a taupe pebbled leather by Kuba. It's in great condition. Okay, there's a pocket right here. 
And if you want, you can keep these zipped up. If you don't have too much you want to fit in the pockets, then you can cinch it up. But if not, if you prefer, you can zip them down and you have a little extra room for space for things. Same on the side of the bag, you can keep it zipped down. Or you can zip them up. Also has a zip top closure. Never fails, you guys, never fails. I'm doing a live. What do you need, babe? Huh? I know. It's like, what do you do? Do you wait for my videos to go up and then, like, you call me or something? <laughs> no doubt. No doubt. What can I do for you, dear? I'm working. <laughs> okay. All right. Are you coming home right now? Oh, okay. Sounds good. All right, honey. Be careful. All right, I will. Okay. Bye. Okay. So you have the top zipper pocket. Thanks, Mindy. It's hot, so I'm pulling it out of my face. Very, very nice roomy large interior with kind of a plum and, and taupe color interior. And I have my ring light set up now so you guys can see the interior of the bags. Much better, it's working out much better. Betsy Johnson Black Sparkly. Yep, it's still available. If it's there and it says available, it's still available. So this is Kuba. Okay. Really soft, lightweight taupe leather. Very pretty, pretty bag. Hi, baby. Joey, you look so different in your new profile picture. I didn't even recognize you. Huh? Oh, you can bring me a piece of pizza if you want. No, nah, don't bring it in. Okay, I'll just wait till I'm done, honey. Thank you. You're live or just a normal video? I'm on a live. Would you like to come say hi? I'm already in bed. You're in bed? Yeah. Why are you in bed, goofball? I'm tired. Tired. Okay, I have the Coach Vintage Coach Willis beautiful bag crossbody. This is actually almost black but navy. I would call this more. I would call it more black, but it's actually navy blue, I believe. You updated it. What did you update? The um, the um, did you want that? The um, little sparkly Betsy Johnson. Okay, so this is in beautiful condition. Somebody messaged me on my Instagram and said that this was selling for five hundred dollars, but. I didn't find it for that, so I'm listing it at comps right now. Okay, Sherry bought the Kuba. So this is now sold. Thank you, Sherry. This is sold. We're going to set that aside, and we're going to finish off with the coach here. So it's got a really, really spacious back pocket. It's got the little top handle. It does have the hang tag. And you know what? While we're sitting here, I am going to polish this one up, too. I'm going to buff it, polish it with my leather and suede cleaner. Yes, this bag is gorgeous. Wait till you see what it looks like after I get done with this. The interior is suede. Hold on. I'm making it all pretty for you. Let's get the little top here. Now look at it. It's like brand new. Okay. Let's do the back. I want to keep this, maybe. Maybe I want to keep this. This is nice. Man, this thing is in primo condition for its age. This is probably a 35 to 40 year old bag. Okay. The back. And then you twist lock this. The link isn't clickable. Of course not. Just my luck. 
Okay, so just send through PayPal to ranskimmy at gmail. I will go ahead and change that. I'll type it in right here. If the link is not clickable, then you can send payment. Okay, here you go. All right, so I pinned this message, you guys. If the link isn't clickable right now, there you go. Just make sure, as always, send what you're purchasing and your shipping address. Also, I'd like to say, you guys, if you have... Um, made a purchase on your through your paypal account and you have not changed your address and your bag goes to the wrong address it's out of my hands um it's going to be your guys's responsibility if you move or whichever reason you change your address it's going to be your responsibility to change it on your paypal please don't message me on instagram after the fact saying that i sent it to the wrong address because it's you know i ship it to the address that comes through with your PayPal. I'm not going to go looking through my Instagram and my emails anymore for um, addresses that don't match up. It's going to be your guys' responsibility to make sure your PayPal shipping address is updated. No ifs, ands, or buts anymore. It's causing a lot, a lot of problems, you guys, because people are moving and they're not changing it on their PayPal and their bags are going to the wrong addresses. Okay, so here is the inside of this beauty. That's the Creed. This is the zipper pocket with a lucky dime in it. So I'm going to keep that in there. All right. It's got the little pull pocket, zipper pocket. Then there's this front pocket here. <laughs> it's got an adjustable strap and it's a beauty okay so this is my coach and I have this adorable Brighton love this Brighton it's in bone ivory color with laser cut flowers there's the little Brighton heart on the front in silver this is a very very pastel yellow super pastel yellow Okay, the back has a zipper pocket. The interior is a black and white floral. Look at the little jewelry, the purse jewelry on it in silver. And then the strap is braided yellow and bone to match the bag. Okay, it looks as if the Vintage Coach has sold. All right, this bag has sold. Thank you. Who purchased that? Christopher. Thank you very much. Okay, so this is a really, really adorable medium, large size hobo. Yes, this bag is adorable. It's got a nice little zipper pull, silver hardware. Love the interior. Slip pockets right, right here. There's one, two slip pockets, a zipper pocket. Bright and Creed. And then the other side has another zipper pocket. And this bag is really, really lightweight. Oh, I'm sorry, Julie. Maybe you can click out and try coming back in again. Okay, so that is my Brighton. I have this really super nice fossil bag. 
Okay, so it's black pebbled leather with a chocolate brown handles. You can carry it by the handles, or this is like a flap that flaps over, and you wear it as a crossbody. So it's an adjustable crossbody. Yes, this is a nice fossil. It's really big. I'm going to polish this up real quick, too. I haven't had time to do it when I got home. I did um, disinfect the interior of all of them. I just haven't time to spiff up the leather, which I'm doing right now as we speak on the ones that could use a little bit. So I'm just getting that. Yeah, the fossil. I love the fossil. Okay, put the little sheen back into it. All right, it's got the little fossil emblem here. All right, and then the inside, it's got the large zipper pull. With the fossil material on the inside, it has a zip, it has a zipper pocket and two slip pockets and a pin pocket. And then this wall has two more pockets. Yay, I'm so glad you guys can see the interior now. It says fossil right there. Okay. Where was the fossil Willis made? Good question. All right, it's got this here. Let me see where the fossil Willis was made for you guys. So this is not fossil Willis, the coach Willis. I'll see where that was made. So this is the fossil crossbody. Let's see, where was it made? It'll say on the creed, right? I believe. Hmm, I don't have my glasses. Let's see. This. Where is the Willis made USA, Costa Rica, China? Where would it say? Oh, it was made in the U.S. Maybe I need to uh, keep this. This was made in the U.S., you guys. So tell me. Vegas chick. Um. What's the importance of where the vintage bags are made? I'd like to know. I'm learning still on, you know, why. I'm going to wait until I hear from Vegas Chick 78. Can you tell me why it being made in USA or Costa Rica or China? Um, what makes the difference? I'm very, very curious before I go on. Because, yeah, it's made in the USA. It says on that, the little creed inside. Let me clean it up. Let's see. Where did my little thing go? I'm going to polish the inside pocket up, too. Hello? Are you there? Yeah, made in the United States of... Does anybody know? Um, let's see. Made in the United States of comp completely. Well, it doesn't matter if it's made in another country. If it's a, it, it can be authentic from another country as well. That doesn't have anything to do with it. No, Marlene, that's actually not, you guys, that's not true. There are many authentic bags that come from outside of the U.S., especially the um, uh, coach. I just want to know why it's important. Okay, somebody just sent me money for the coach again, and it's already sold. You guys, you guys. So you're just whoever just sent the money for... The coach is getting a refund because it's already sold. 
All right, next, let's go to Chrissy. The Kuba's not available. It's sold. I'll be sending you a refund. <sighs> All right, hold on, you guys. For some reason, people aren't getting it right now. Um, let's see here. I got to get my phone. I got to start sending refunds. Or should I, what should I do? No, forget it. I'm just going to get going with these bags. Um, the coach is sold, the Kuba is sold. So whoever just paid me just right now for them, you're getting a refund. All right, here's this super cute vintage juicy. I guess I'm spending too much time on one bag. So everybody's buying purchase bags. I don't know. This is a really, really cute little juicy couture satchel. Um, it is a vegan leather. It's got the cute little J on here. It's got the cute little juicy emblem on here. This is in new condition. Love, love, love the interior. So you have two hot pink pockets. I don't know, Kelly. I don't remember. I've had this headband for years. Um, just Google headbands. Okay, so it opens like this. And then the inside is so cute. And like I said, it's in brand new condition. The crossbody strap is adjustable and you can take it off if you like. And it's like a faux pebbled leather. Little rolled vegan leather handles. Oh. Hmm. Okay, Mother Bunny. Are the ones that are sold, get the red dot by them? Yeah, after I'm done. I can't do it right now while I'm live, but after I'm done, I will definitely go down and put the red dots next to everything. Well, that's cool, Sherry. Yes, Ashley, the ones that say New York are before the ones that say just USA. See, and I'm missing. Maybe you could have a whiteboard and write each bag. <clears throat> or maybe, or maybe people could just hear when I'm saying that they're sold, unless they're coming on late. That could be a problem, right? All right, next bag is this one. This is the one that looks like a Gucci that I thrifted yesterday. I had a lot of interest in this one. So if you're one of them that wants this one, this is not Gucci. It's by the brand um, Kalisa. It's brand new with tags. It's a Safiano leather. It's got these cute little gold purse jewelry on it with the drawstring. Opens up. It's got a little dust bag with it. I just got a little piece of plastic on my computer. Excellent idea, Tanya. Excellent idea. Okay, then there's a zipper pocket and a little slip pocket on the inside. Isn't it adorable? I love this little guy. Okay, pull it shut. It's got the little clochette on it. And what's in here? It's got a little key ring on it, I would imagine. Let's see. It's got the little key ring on it. I guess I suppose if people are new here, obviously they haven't got the idea of how it works yet. But um, what happens is when I sell a bag, I say it here, I put it to the side, and then when this live is over, I will go down the list and I'll mark the ones that have sold, sold. So if you're not sure, it's best to read the comments up or just wait until the live is over and see what's available. Okay, so this is the Kalisa bag. you up close okay then I have oh look at this this is a vintage Etienne Anye oxblood 
from the 1960s gorgeous little handbag that I purchased at a little vintage boutique yesterday. Okay, so Ashley just bought the bucket bag. This is sold, you guys. No longer available. Thank you, Ashley. This is super cute. You can wear it as a shoulder bag or like a little baguette style. It's in a smooth oxblood leather. It's got this great little detail, hardware detail on it. Twist lock opens like this. Yeah, I could do that, Michelle. Let's do that. Let's do that. Okay, all the bags that have sold, I'm gonna put behind me. I guarantee you people will still buy them, but it's not gonna hurt to try. So here are the bags that have sold. Two people bought this one. Two or three people bought this one. Okay, those have sold. Let's give that a shot, Michelle. You never know. Okay, there we go. So you just open this up with a little twist lock and you have your little purse. It's so, so cute. Love the leather on. I love vintage. Etienne Anya, love vintage hardware and all that good stuff. Isn't it cute? A little feet on the bottom. Okay. Easy, kids. Okay, this one is a one that I really was shocked at. This is, um, okay, so there's no label on it, but the bags, what I did was that Google Lens, and the bags that popped up, none of them had the name brand on them, just the prices of what they sold for. Pixie, Pixie. This one that was the same bag, it only had one gold handle on it, was selling for almost $300. So it's this one is from the 1950s or 60s, in between that era. It's got little silver top handles, little wooden beads. It has feet on the bottom. Okay, then it's got a twist lock closure. And this is silver also. You open it up and look how big it gets. It's a nice red interior with a little vintage zip pocket that opens up nice and wide. What a beautiful little bag for my vintage girls that like to collect. Show you the what it looks like on the top isn't it pretty I love it okay so this I just have it listed as vintage wicker bag really really cute Sherry I know I love it all right then I have my Carl Lagerfeld googled this one and this one is a super rare one um, most of the Carl Lagerfeld cat bags have the cat face with a pair of like sunglasses on. This one is a lot more rare and it's so cute. It's in brand new condition. The whiskers have silver studs. The ears have silver studs. The eye has a little star, silver star, and then the blue eye is a little grommet. So let me show you guys that up close. And it is Safiano leather. Brand new condition. No signs of wear anywhere. Do I like silk? I could take it or leave it. I don't like or dislike it. Okay, um, the interior is perfect with a zipper and slip pockets. All right, goodbye, Brock, you're being blocked. Block, block, block. Bye-bye. 
Okay. He's gone. Just another troll. Okay, so this is in excellent condition. Nice medium size. Excellent condition. It's a red nose, blue eyes, white ears, white whiskers. And adorable. Okay. Then... Let's see. All right. Miss Belvins, what did you purchase? Oops, where'd you go? Open. Why aren't you opening? I gotta see what Miss Belvins just purchased. Okay, so Sherry got the Kuba. Christopher got the coach. Tanya Harmon, you're getting refunded. Chrissy White, you're getting refunded. Ashley Jones, you're getting the little bucket bag. Marlene Blevins, you did not write down what you're, what you're purchasing, so I'm going to have to refund you. Okay, so this is a gorgeous, really gorgeous. Okay, Marlene, you bought the Juicy. This is now sold. Okay, thank you, Marlene. You're gonna have to somehow send me a message through PayPal to let me know or the money will be refunded and it'll be up for sale. Um, it's just, it's getting really confusing when people don't leave their addresses or items purchased. Okay, look at this beauty, you guys. This is a camel color pebbled leather large tote. Love the chain detail on it. No, I know, Marlene. I know you're telling me here, but I got to have it on a PayPal note because I can't come back and look through after I get lots of other purchases and stuff. Just, I know, for, it happens when you forget. Just send me a note through PayPal. Not a big deal. That way I don't have to go searching through and get your match your name to your PayPal account, to your address. You know, there's a there's kind of a lot to this after after the bag sales are over. I have to match up people if they don't tell me what they purchased or what their address is. Okay, so here's the front. And this bag is by um this bag is by Charles. Charles David, and the interior, you guys, the interior suede. Look at that. Suede interior. Nice and roomy. Two slip pockets and a zipper pocket. If you would, that would be great. Thank you. Okay, so there you have that. Then... This plus, if there's not a note through PayPal, I can, you know, some, I know you wouldn't, Marlene, but there are pe people say, well, that's not the one I purchased. I purchased this. And I'm like, no, actually, here's your note that says what you purchased. So it keeps everything clear for us, too, for you and I. Nice scrunchy pocket, really wide sides, really pretty handle, toggle closure, zipper top. And see, here's the name. Okay, well, this, so the interior is so, so soft. All right, let's close that. Okay, look at how wide the base is, you guys. Super wide. So this thing will fit probably your life and maybe your husband's too. <laughs> Just a gorgeous bag. Okay, Charles David. And put that over here. All right. This is the Carmen Los Angeles. This is so cute. I love this. Look, it looks like a jacket. It's quilted with like the little, these are not real pockets. They're just for decoration, but it's got chain detail all around the front, bottom, the back as well with the zipper pocket, chain handles. This is a large bag too. 
Zip top closure. Brown interior with slip pockets and a zipper pocket, a little bit of string. Here's, your, here's the zipper pocket. All different prices, Charlotte. And then it's got two slip pockets right there. Side, bottom. And this is actually really lightweight as well. Okay, so this is the Carmen bag in black and gold. In case I didn't mention that. Oh, she did? Okay. Thank you. This is sold, you guys. Let's see, where can I put it where you guys can see? Right there. Okay, so that's sold. Um, and then, watch out, baby. You want to get the paper? Here you go. This is cool. I love this crossbody. So awesome for travel, shopping, whatever you like. Genuine leather by Gold Luck. I believe it's Gold Luck. I'm not exactly sure. Thank you, the luminous you, very much. I appreciate it. So this has got this. I love the way this fits. Let me show you. It fits like this. I love the way it's wide and then it like lays on your hip really comfortably. Um, lots and lots of pockets. So you've got two front pockets. This one, this one, this is great for your lip gloss. I would totally put my lip gloss in here. And then this large pocket, that's leather. That's a lot raw leather right there. Okay, the back has a very generous size slip pocket. Then the top zip. And on the inside, you have another zipper pocket right there, leather lined. And I don't know, I just really like these bags. Also, there's a, slip, a zipper slip right here where you can put your phone in across this way, like that. Or if you conceal carry, you can also do that if it's small. And it would be a right hand it would be a right hand draw. No, I'm not happy with my Kate Spade bag. I'm taking it back, you guys. I didn't use it. I just took it out and then I put it on and I was like, you know what? It's not me. I loved it when I saw it and then I got it home. I tried it on after I did the video. It's right here in my bag, getting ready to go back right here. If anybody wants to buy it, it's in here, but you're going to have to pay what I paid plus shipping. Let me know. If you guys want to buy this bag, does anybody want to buy it? There's my receipt. But first, let me finish with this. So this is by Gold Luck, okay? Genuine leather, Gold Luck crossbody. Um, either you can purchase it or I'll take it back. I paid... Total was $80.82. Let me block out any information that's on here. Let's see. No, I just didn't. It just, I don't know. It. You know how sometimes bags just make you happy? That one didn't. Where's my camera? Can you guys see that? There we go, $80.82. Plus you would have to pay shipping and if you PayPal me, you would have to do it through the way, I think it's like friends and family, I can't remember, where it wouldn't take, where PayPal doesn't take a percentage out. So it's gonna be, let's see, it would be 80 plus um, $8 shipping and then PayPal takes, so you'd have to add 20% on the 80. And then $8 shipping. If you want it, that's great. If not, no big deal. Hmm. 
Email is not working for you, huh? Well, here, I'll type it in again. Maybe you typed it in wrong. Okay, so that's my email. That's all of my bags for today, you guys. That is all for today. Is Let me know if it's working now, Sherry. I don't know why it's not working for you. So those are the bags that are sold right now. Don't, um, the R in Rand's Kimmy is not capital. Maybe that's why she had a problem, Kristen. It's a small, it's a lowercase R. Maybe she typed it in a big R, uppercase R. Okay, you guys, do I have any more questions before I go or anything you'd like to see again? Um, when is the next sale so you can be ready? No idea. I'm one of those people that I'm fly by the seat of my pants. I never know when's going to. Oh, it's okay, Christian. Not a big deal. I fly by the seat of my pants. It's one of those deals when I have time and when I have inventory. And unfortunately, I can't give a specific time or day. It's just, it's luck of the draw with me because I have to thrift items first. So I don't see any more questions coming through. You're very welcome, Sherry. And thank you, everybody, that purchased these awesome bags behind me. I will get them all packaged up and ready to ship. Please make sure that your address matches your payment through PayPal. If not, that's a bummer for both of us. So um, I'm not, like I said, don't send me anything through Instagram saying you've changed your address or anything like that. It's got to be done on PayPal. All right, you guys, so I am going to get going. Stay humble, stay kind, work hard, play harder, and I will see you guys. I'm reading the next comment. <gasps> yes, I totally do. <laughs> All right, you guys, I love you all. Bye.